House Republicans said they revealed a lack of oversight of research funded by the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases during the first of two days interviewing the agency's former director, Anthony Fauci. Select Subcommittee on the Coronavirus Pandemic Chairman Brad Winstrup said, Dr. Fauci's testimony today uncovered drastic and systemic problems in America's public health systems. While leading the nation's COVID-19 response and influencing public narratives, he simultaneously had no idea what was happening under his own jurisdiction at NIAID. Fauci, who led the largest branch of the National Institutes of Health for over 35 years, is a key witness for Republicans in the investigation over the origin of SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID-19. In August, the subcommittee's Republicans issued a report identifying that Fauci was intimately involved in the drafting and publication of a scientific paper published in Nature Medicine that purportedly debunked the hypothesis that the virus originated in the Wuhan Institute of Virology, an institution that indirectly received NIH funding through the private research firm EcoHealth Alliance. According to Wenstrup, Fauci testified that he signed off on all foreign and domestic research grants without personally receiving the proposal during his tenure at the NIH. Wenstrup also said that Fauci could not describe any mechanism that would allow the NIAID to oversee foreign laboratories that receive funding from the United States.